Well, a lot of that advice has been questioning in my mind. But joining me now are Pete Moray from Witch and consumer champion Lynn Falls Wood. Now, the whole point is, I mean, I'm trying to relate it to myself. First of all, I don't want a machine that's likely to go on fire. I do not want to watch the machine going on fire. I mean, the whole thing is ridiculous. Advice is to not use these machines. And the first thing L is... Like government. Yeah, what I was asked find? to do it nearly two years ago for the first time. And here we are. And the government, I think, is sitting on their hands. Everyone at Whirlpool and their staff should be made to watch your package there. That was a, a, a brilliant Whirlpool that those people felt watching all that smoke going past their windows. Mm. And they're the 11th, 12th, there are 18 floors in that building. And then think of the firemen that are going in there, because I know from talking to them, their hearts were pounding because they didn't know what they'd find. And the last time they went into a big block of flats fire, there were deaths. Yeah, so yeah so I was just really going to say important. that the whole block... Sorry, don't I interrupt mm. you for a you second. Interrupt, OK. But this was an independent review of the government, and I found that the system's broken. The recall system just doesn't work properly. Yeah, am I being naive here in thinking that the cost of, of employing more engineers, you know, all the effort to try and check them, to try and modify... So that um, the, the system that we have is safe. Yeah, we should point out eventually Absolutely a block not. of that. It's an American company. Is that why the government aren't hitting harder? Um, well, it's a huge company. It's one of the biggest... <laughs> but it has to be down... The